Pakistan is on the verge of taking its first steps in harnessing nature's bountiful blessings on our country. Climate change has emerged as a revolutionary opportunity for developing countries and the critical challenge is to create long-term sustainable solutions that will transform the way we produce and consume energy, a greener future. This daunting challenge has enabled Pakistan and the world population to conserve dwindling resources and find ways to steadily energize our industrial and social infrastructure. Pakistan, being at a crossroad of energy challenges and the sustainability of our economic momentum, is now seriously prepared to address the nation's energy needs of the future. Thus embracing the immediate need to accelerate the pace at which our country invests in renewable energy. It is heartening to see that in Pakistan, a socially responsible and highly competitive corporation, the Fawji Fertilizer Company Limited, has spread its vision to undertake concrete steps in establishing large-scale renewable energy projects to ensure a greener future for our coming generations. It is a matter of singular honor that as Fawji Fertilizer diversifies its close to undertake to develop the abundant but neglected renewable resources. In doing so, it has shown the way to meet the energy crisis in a record-setting pace and putting Pakistan firmly on a self-sustaining energy pedestal. The commissioning of the first 50 megawatt wind project at Jimbir is a demonstrated reality and there is no turning back for Pakistan to be energy dependent on purchased foreign resources that had crippled the growth and economy of the country. Fawji Fertilizer Company Limited is the largest urea manufacturer in Pakistan. It was incorporated in 1978 as a joint venture between a leading charitable trust, Fawji Foundation, and Haldo Topso AS of Denmark. The company is operating three world-scale urea plants with an aggregate design capacity of over 2 million metric tons per annum. With a comprehensive policy for diversification, FFC in Pakistan is now at the threshold of pioneering landmark wind power plants aimed at enhancing the country's energy security through green and clean power. A special purpose venture FFC Energy Limited was established in 2009 to develop Pakistan's first 50 megawatt wind energy project at Chimpir District Tata in Sindh and in a short span by June 2011 FFCEL became Pakistan's first wind power electricity generation company to achieve financial close. FFC has the unique distinction of developing Pakistan's first 50 megawatt wind power project within a record timeline of 8 to 10 months. This project has become a benchmark and a game changer for developing renewable energy resources in general and also for the most promising world wind corridor in particular. It is now an engine of unlimited green energy source. This is also at the same time create an inexhaustible pool of opportunities for Pakistani engineers and technology experts to play a role in nation building for all times to come. This has been that long-awaited humble first step that FFC through FFCL has taken. There is no looking back now. 25 out of 33 wind turbine towers have been locally manufactured for the first time in Pakistan at Descon's tower manufacturing facility. 
Established with an investment of $134 million, the grid interconnection facilities for this project were energized on 30th October 2012 and thereby all 33 wind turbine generators at this wind farm were connected with the national grid on the 7th of November 2012. Major civil works comprising turbine foundations, substations, workshops, dormitory and roads have also been completed. Since 2009, the FFCEL wind power project consistently met all its scheduled timelines promptly and by August 2012, all civil, mechanical and electrical works related to grid interconnection facility HV switchyard, MV substation and MV collection system was completed. This long-awaited milestone was achieved through the coordinated efforts of Ministry of Water and Power, AEDB, NEPRA, CPPA, NTDC, HESCO and FFCEL. A powerful 132 kV switchyard pre-commissioning was also completed in compliance with Energy Purchase Agreement on 30th October and subsequently on 1st November 2012. The 22 kV substation was commissioned. By 25th September 2012, Tuf Nord, the independent engineer, had issued the Certificate for Readiness of Energization, verifying FFCEL's preparedness for grid energization. The project also engaged Nordex, a global technology leader from Germany, and Descon Engineering Limited to ensure technical excellence. Keeping in view the national importance of FFCEL wind power project, multiple commissioning teams, foreign and local, along with stakeholder parties, were present at the site to ensure timely commissioning of this signature project of Pakistan. Since all works and testing have been completed, FFCEL's commercial operations at the Jimpeed Wind Power Project are expected soon. Establishing the country's first wind farm was not the sole criteria of the project team. The people of Jimpeed and their uplift was also the focal point of the project. Several CSR programs have been actively deployed by FFC since 1982 and comprehensively focuses on education, healthcare, clean drinking water, poverty alleviation, sports promotion, environmental protection, disaster relief and rehabilitation for the deprived masses. Understanding the plight and problems faced by the local population, FFC's Corporate Social Responsibility Team has also initiated a community uplift and support program worth 100,000 US dollars for the year 2012 and 2013 along with its partner Nordex at Jimpeed and surrounding villages. FFC and FFCEL are committed to nation-building activities and promises to continue with the same vigor to minimize the severity of such global challenges. Our goal is to ensure self-sufficiency in our national energy needs and a safe and healthy living environment for our future generations.